Hey everyone, how's it going? So what am I working on now? Well, I'm working on the Escort. It's almost together. Uh, I still got quite a bit to do, but it's almost together. I wanted to show you something kind of interesting. Remember what this thing looked like? Okay, this thing was parked for years and years and years. This is the original battery that's been in it for years and years and years. Okay. I don't know how this happens, but it does happen every once in a blue moon. I don't even know the date on this battery. To be honest with you, I don't know. I have the slightest idea how to tell what the date code actually is. Actually, can I shut off the beep on this thing? The beep is irritating. Beep. Oh, yeah, there you go. Beep. Off. Perfect. Okay. So let's go back. Let's go back to check. Okay. 12 volt in vehicle. Battery test. It's a regular flooded. Uh, Coco cranking amps. I don't know what the cranking amps of this thing is. So oh, 640. 640. And at 2020 Equinox, the battery was no good. So, yeah, just kind of interesting. Um, but yeah. So, motor's in. Let's flow inside of this thing. Hang on. I can't lift, I can't open the door all the way. And I got the bum knee. All right, I still gotta put axles and everything else in it. It's got engine oil in it. Disconnect the battery because the chime keeps going off. Stopped. Okay. All right. Well, like I said, I have to. Uh, I got to put the axles in it. I have to put coolant in it. The guy wants to fix the AC. Um, I think he wants to fix something with the power windows. Yeah, so. Uh, yeah, we still got a little bit of work to do to this thing, but it's up and running, yay. Um, and it don't sound bad. I gotta hook the exhaust up, obviously you heard I got the exhaust is disconnected. Um, all right, so that's it for right now. I just wanted to show you that. I thought it was kind of interesting, especially the battery. The battery kind of blows my mind, actually. Um, let me just double check because I don't think there's a date code on this thing. So, let me see. Yeah, it doesn't have any visible type of date coding on it that I can see. Nothing on the sides. Nothing up my sleeve. Um, I'm sure there's a date code here somewhere. Oh, wait, wait, what's this? Right there. 12 of 19. Okay. So this battery's been sitting for five years, basically, and it still starts the car, and this test is not that bad. Kind of amazing, really. But, uh, all right, well, I just thought that was interesting, thought I'd show you. Um, I'm not gonna cover putting the rest of this thing back together because there's just no point to it. Um, but once I get ready to road test it, I'll share that with you. I don't know if I'm gonna road test it anywhere, but. Um, probably just park them on. Alright, hopefully you're getting something out of my videos. If you are, hit that like button. If you could, please subscribe. Alright guys, have a great day. Keep wrenching.